cannot bring your bone. Okay, there you go. Good girl. Oh, Mucha went to eat it. Come on, Mucha. Mucha, let's go for a walk. Come on. You gotta go for a walk now. Let's Ready go. Go for a walk. Let's go for a walk. Come on. <laughs> Baby, you're like really shaking. It's time to go for a walk, little girl. Let's go for a walk, Mucha. You ready, babe? I just need to put my shoes on. It looks pretty out today, but it's still very windy and cold. Bye, Pokey. Summer rain on a window Watch the time float on Cool air blows a memento As I fall behind jacket today it's like finally spring weather oh, I could honestly just be wearing my t-shirt after class I went with a friend and we went to this place called the forest cafe and I didn't know about it but it's right next to UNIP and it's so cute it's like this little vegan restaurant and they have like soups and salads and vegan tacos all sorts of really yummy recipes and I snuck a few pictures of etched while we were there and um, it was my first time like hanging out with that friend. We've been in a couple classes together, but because school was online for so long, I never had a chance to be like, hey, let's go out. And after lunch, we did a little bit of thrifting. Uh, there were amazing pieces there today, but nothing fit me. Like I found a couple oversized pieces, but they were just like a little bit too oversized. Or, you know, I found one shirt that was super cute. It was like a peach color, but then it had giant shoulder pads. And I can't really pull that off. So I was like, oh, maybe next time. So I just got ready and I'm about to go meet someone at a cafe.
did have a good walk. We met lots of cute doggies. We did. Yeah. Yeah. Gotta love the tail wag. Hear my own voice. So they're definitely noise cancelling. I mean, it's gonna have to be tested with. I'll be there in 15, baby. You know you got me. You got me. Wish you knew me at 19. Back then I wasn't talking to anyone but me. Though when I think about it, that wouldn't even make a difference. When your funeral feels that you make that your mission. Morning. Oops. I am going to school today, so Keith and I are taking a rest day from the gym. <sighs> I only have three weeks left of this semester, or let's see, yeah, three weeks left. And so everything's kind of speeding up. I have two papers due next week. And then after that, I'll have finals, and then a couple more papers and presentations. I'm gonna go ahead and jump into a short little workout. I, I probably only have time for like 15 minutes, so I can do that really quickly. <sighs> It always sucks changing into workout clothes in the morning though, especially because it's still a little cold. I'm so cozy. To see you clothed in moonlight, what a beautiful light. And I don't know if I'm okay. I know that something ain't right. It was already like 12.30, almost 1, and I hadn't eaten, so I was super hungry. We made eggs, some avocado toast, and some veggies, and then I just got a little bit of work done. I have a group project due in a bit, so I wrote my part of the essay, and now we're on a doggy walk. Yeah, I used to think, I was just telling Keith that I think the reason I have really bad acid reflex is because when I was a kid, I used to think swallowing pills without water was like made me really cool because all of my siblings and friends would struggle and they'd have to take like the liquid form of the medicine and I'd be like, oh, it's not that bad. You can just swallow it without anything. And apparently that's really bad for your esophagus. So I think that's kind of exasperated my acid reflux problem. But yeah, I just had some granola after lunch and it's been giving me a little bit of heartburn and Guy was asking why my body's so sensitive to stuff like that.
36. Oh. I always get ready really early, but then I'm super slow to leave. Like I'll be ready an hour early, like with my stuff packed and everything. And then I just don't get off my butt to go. <laughs> Especially in the morning because I'm like full from breakfast. But we're gonna go and meet at Savoy to have some coffee, pick up some cappuccinos there. And we're gonna go to Petron Hill after that and just kind of walk around. And uh, it's sort of the last chance to really take in the cherry blossom. So maybe we'll get some pictures of that and just kind of walk and enjoy the view of Prague. And this park is really, this park is one of the best in Prague, in my opinion. There's the Petron Tower. At the Petron Tower, you can go up and get like a 360 view of the city. And it's also really cool in the summertime. They have like festivals there and sometimes they have like, what's that called? Where there's like the horses, it's like a carousel. They have that in the summertime and they sell like lemonade and ice cream, so it can be fun. And you can also check out the gardens at the top. I went there with my mom, I'll put the carts here so you can go watch that video later if you want. But it's very beautiful, especially in the springtime when there's cherry blossoms. But anyway, I need to go like right now because I'm running late. <laughs> I don't care today what the neighbors might say Put on my rain boots, my favorite chiffon dress I don't care today what the neighbors might say Cause I could stay inside and type away inside